Election Day is less than 24 hours away, so we sent our political reporter Michael Lagerwell out to chat with Mesa County Democrats and Republicans to see how they are feeling the day before the general election. Both parties have made phone calls, sent flyers, and knocked on doors. And now election day is only one night away. We're feeling great. We think we're going to have a great day tomorrow. We think we're going to win everything here in Mesa County. Yeah, we're anxious. You know, nationally, there's all kinds of stuff going on all over the country. And, uh, you know, Colorado is probably in pretty good shape. In October 29th, Emerson College poll shows two major state races firmly leaning Democrat with Governor Jared Polis leading Heidi Ganahl by 13 points and Senator Michael Bennett leading Joe O'Day by eight points. Um, but Michael Bennett does a lot for us and I think he'll, he'll care, bring it home. Still, Republicans are confident. We are very confident. We think Joe O'Day's got a great chance to get rid of Michael Bennett. Then there's the contentious District 3 race for the United States House between Adam Frisch and Representative Lauren Boebert. I think Lauren is gonna win. Pretty handily. But Democrats say Boebert overstayed her welcome. People are people are sick of uh, Boebert, you know? I mean, that's all there is to it. Despite each party's distaste for the other, each echoed a similar message at the end of their interviews. Vote what you should know, vote where your heart is, and get your ballot in. Get out and vote. Make sure your ballot is filled out and turned in by 7 p.m. tomorrow. First on the Western Slope, Michael Lagerwell, KREX 5 News. Well, that gets the blood pumping. Now, after you've submitted your ballot, both the Mesa County Democrats and Republicans are holding watch parties. The GOP will be at Suplesio Field and Warehouse 2565, while the Democrats will gather at Charlie Dwellington's.